Welcome to a, another video guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to stream movies to your PC, sorry to your Xbox from your PC rather. Uh, if I just go into my documents and go to my videos, as you can see I've got an absolute load of videos there. Um, that, you know, you can watch them on your PC but it's sort of a bit, you know, you're sort of restricted in a way. Uh, basically I prefer to watch them on my, on my telly uh, and I can do that via streaming them to my Xbox. So um, yeah, today I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, it's fairly simple. First of all, though, what you want to do is go to Start Menu, and ah, I removed it, but basically go to um, Network and Sharing Center. Uh, go on to Change Advanced Sharing Settings. Scroll all the way down to oh yeah, sorry. Make sure that you turn Network Discovery on, and I think Public Folder Sharing as well. Uh, but also take a look into Media Streaming. Choose Media Streaming and you can name your library or whatever else uh... basically you want to um... well it, it it should sort of say your xbox 360 there uh... you can't remove it so yeah just basically make sure it's clicked on allowed or allow all one of the two um, so yeah that does that alright and then just click ok and that's basically what you do on your pc for the minute um, whilst you're here you might as well load up um, media center Uh, which always takes ages to load. Uh, so I'm going to um, take you over to the Xbox, show you what's going on here. Uh, what you want to do is you want to go over to uh, Media Center first off. Now, as you can see, actually, whilst it's finding the uh, PC on my Xbox, it's come up on Media Center here with uh, an option to set it up now. If you click that, uh, yeah, might as well, but uh, I'll do that later. Um, if you click that, just go through all the next and whatever, and you'll get to enter the setup key. Uh, now, you see, click uh, on, if you take it back to the Xbox now, you go to, uh, if you get this screen, just go to set up new connection. Uh, that's all you want. That's only because I had it set up previously and I disabled it to show you guys what to do. Uh, so there you go. Basically, you've, you've got your uh, you've got your numbers there. Uh, so what you want to do is go into uh, extender setup and type them in there. Uh, there is if you don't get that screen, there is another way to do it. You go down. I think you go to extras. Uh, nope, that's wrong. Must be settings then. So if you go all the way to the bottom and go to settings, or ah yes, yeah, settings. And then you go to add extender. There you go. Uh, next, there you go. And then you're on basically the same screen. Uh, so you just want to enter your setup key here: not not one six three seven uh, nine eight, and click next. Take about I think about a minute uh, if you've got a decent uh, connection. Uh, your Xbox should start to well, it'll go to a black screen first of all, and then display the uh, media center. Uh, settings. There you go, Media Center uh, connecting. <clears throat> okay, then, so now uh, you can see that it's built my media library. This is basically adding all of the music, videos, photos, whatever off your computer uh, and it's sticking them in all in um, sort of a, a bundle that can be read by your Xbox and you're done fairly standard uh, sorry fairly standard, I don't know what that was about, uh, pretty easy to do rather um, closing that down, you don't really need that anymore now uh, as you can see on your Xbox you will have well this up uh, if you go to video library for a start because uh, this video is about streaming videos to your telly uh, it oops it, it's got them all there whatever um, so yeah you can you can watch them through here I prefer not to because I well I'll, I'll just show you hold on okay if you go to movies movie library rather oops uh, there you go see now it can look for as long as you want but it won't find any unless you go to 
Oops, tasks, settings. Get into X media libraries, I think. Very slow, I don't know what's going on here. Um, movies. Next. And then you want to add files, folders rather. And just select your. Sorry. Uh, just select the uh, folder that all your movies are located on. So for me, it's going to be in hard drive F. Going to be PC folders. And I want to go down to my videos. And just make sure that's ticked. And click next. And yep, that's done. You just got to click uh, yes, use these locations, and then finish. And now, if you go back to movies, it should say searching for them, and then it will hopefully find them. If it doesn't, it's going to be a complete fail. There you go. Uh, that's 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 all right. Um, you can, whoops. It's being very slow. It's being very jerky at the minute. I don't quite know what's going on. Uh, but you can. Oh shit, come on. Now I've frozen it. It's probably because I have um, Camtasia recording my computer screen and the PVR recording at the same time, which is lagging up my computer, which is meaning that it's not sending to the Xbox properly. Anyway, uh, basically, yeah, that's sort of frozen and died on me, so. Yeah, you can watch it through that way, or you can go through the video library. I'm just going to show you another quick way to do it. Go to your desktop, or uh, desktop, I mean your um, start page, rather, whatever it is. I can't even remember. Dashboard, that's the one. I knew it began with a D. Um, and if you go over to my Xbox and video library, Tweed your PC, my videos. There you go, you can watch them all in here. Uh, personally, I prefer to do this because. Um, what can we watch? Let's watch Green Zone. Um, personally, I prefer to do this because it allows you to skip sort of in, in bite sized chunks as well, which I noticed that the others don't do. Uh, for example, it'll let you do chapters because at the top you can see it's got the sort of sectioned off into little bits, uh, which the media, um, media player does, doesn't. It doesn't let you do that, it just sort of fast forwards or doesn't so um yeah that's that's what that's how I prefer to do it it might not be as clean as the others but it just adds that extra bit of uh, functionality that I I like on it so um yeah I hope that that did it for you I hope that um, you get it set up working alright and uh, I'll see you next time with another video so thank you very much for watching